Hello traders, here are our top trading tips for Thursday, September the 8th. The British pound declined on Wednesday in the aftermath of the inflation hearings. Bank of England Governor Mark Carney struck a positive tone saying he was serene with the Bank of England's monetary action after the Brexit vote. The pound finds itself trading still within the higher realm of its short-term value. However, yesterday's selling may indicate that the British pound may still have more short-term selling ahead. Yesterday's UK manufacturing production data was disappointing too, and this may add to some negative sentiment. After making strong gains on Tuesday against the US dollar, the euro traded in a tight range and did face some selling on Wednesday. German economic data continues to turn in poor results. However, it is the European Central Bank monetary policy pronouncements today that will have most investors on edge. Most analysts believe the central bank may announce small changes to monetary policy, but nothing drastic. What European Central Bank President Mario Draghi says about the health of the overall EU economy is what could cause volatility for the euro. If Draghi admits the economy is still struggling, the euro could face more selling today. Gold continued to hold on to plenty of its gains made early this week. The precious metal did run into some selling on Wednesday after finding a rush of buyers on Tuesday. Perhaps some profit taking was the reason, but it should be said that gold has entered this known short term range a few times, traversing around 1,345 US dollars an ounce without being able to really break through strong resistance levels and sustain momentum. Gold may continue to range trade in this territory until investors feel they have more clarity with all central banks. The US dollar continues to find itself being sold against the yen. Asian investors have seen negative data from both Japan and China, and this has created negative trading sentiment. The Bank of Japan has gone on record saying that they are not done interjecting stimulus into the Japanese economy, but there are concerns that the central bank's actions may not be effective enough. Short term, we may continue to see traders attempting to sell the US dollar against the yen if risk appetite continues to decrease in Asia. Thanks for watching and have a great trading day.